hello friends welcome to engineering tutorial so today uh, we are going to uh, resume our discussion on uh, the signal operations basic signal operations so far we have discussed uh, many signal operations uh, starting from uh, time reversal amplitude scaling amplitude inversion uh, now we will uh, discuss another signal operation which is signal addition okay signal addition so basically what the signal addition means that if we have two signals x1t and x2t here we are discussing about continuous time domain then we'll discuss about discrete so if we have two signals no matter what the values of this signals are so what we have to do at each the time instance okay at each of the time instance we have to add their amplitude values let the amplitude here be a1 here it is a2 here it is a3 and here let it be small a1 small a2 small a3 so we have to add these values okay add the amplitude values at each time instant then we have to join the points so we'll add a1 plus a1 a2 plus a2 a3 plus a3 this is at time instant t1 this is a time instant t2 this is a time instant t3 okay then the values which we will get we have to join them and the shape that we get that will be the resultant signal so this is the basic operation now we will uh, discuss it with the help of some examples okay so let us do that okay so we just discussed the basic concept of signal addition now let us perform signal addition and some basic signals so first let us take a simple signal test signal uh, which is the uh, unit step signal okay the unit step signal ut so we know unit step signal for positive time interval it has a constant value 1 suppose we add it with the same unit step signal so what will be the result so the value of these two signals is constant which is 1 for the positive time interval t greater than 0 so the resultant signal will be the same as an amplitude scaled signal at each of the time interval whatever time interval we take let's say t1 t2 or t3 up to tn it is 1 same here t1 t2 so at each of these time instants the value of the signal is constant 1 so at each point so it will be 1 plus 1 1 plus 1 1 so it will be 2 so the resultant signal it will be this so it is same as the amplitude scaled signal so the signal here is amplified okay the signal here is amplified to 
ut okay similarly if we take let us say two ramp signals okay with slope 1 let us take two ramp signals okay this is a ramp signal it means at 1 the amplitude will be 1 at 2 the amplitude will be 2 and so on so if we add it with another ramp signal okay so if we add it with another amp or uh, uh, same ramp signal the result will be a ramp signal with slope equals to 2 when it means it will be amplified it will be 2 rt because at each duration each of these time intervals it will get add at t equals to 1 the value is 1 here also at t equals to 1 the value is 1 so the resultant at t equals to 1 it will be 1 plus 1 2 okay it will be 2 this point similarly at t equals to 2 the value here is 2 here also it is 2 so here when the values will get added up it will become 4 here so it will be amplified with a slope equals to here the slope is 1 okay so this is the thing 